So, this is our new parrot. He is uh, the unusual variety in the pet trade. He's a greater Jardine uh, African parrot, much like my Timna African Grey over there. And uh, basically, we got him to be a pet for our pet African Grey because our old cockatiel, after 15 years of ownership, died. Uh, this little puppy here, we just had him sexed. He's a male. He's, um, his hatch date was uh, July 28th, 2017, and this is November 3rd. We've had him for less than a week. He wasn't cheap. Actually paid as much for him as I would have paid for another gray. But I always wanted one of these. I've done a lot of research. I've had birds all my life. And um, when I say all my life, I got my first bird when I was eight. I've had birds continually, at least one, usually more than one. And I'm now 66. So the cockatiel we had for 15 years. And we kind of adopted him from a guy who just had it in a garage all by itself. There's no way to keep any animal. Um, I gave the guy 60 bucks for him. He said he was eight months old. She was eight months old. Who knows? Um, we had it 15 years. Before that, we had another cockatiel that was a flat-out adoption. Somebody just gave it to me. A guy who owned a dog grooming shop. Somebody had just dropped it off at his shop and said, I can't take care of this bird. Would you take it? And he said yes. And he gave it to me complete with cage. And that was a female, too. And I had her 16 years. So... Anyway, the cockatiel, Zoe, was here before Morgan, the Timna. Um, Morgan is nine years old. And when she died, I knew Morgan was going to need a friend. So, I did a bunch of research and came up with, I either wanted a greater Jardine or a cape parrot. And the capes have gotten crazy expensive and they're totally unavailable anyway. These are African birds. Okay, so I bought this Jardine. He's a cool looking bird. He's very young. He's gonna his coloration is gonna change a lot. And he'll probably get considerably larger. The guy who sold him to me <coughs> is a real expert. Mark of uh, Parrots of the World on Sunrise Highway in Long Island. I like the guy too. Um, years ago, I bought a, uh, an Indian ringneck from him. It's a wonderful bird. Independent bird, though. You know, it wasn't a cuddly thing by any stretch. So this is the greater Jardine. I'll show you my Timna. He's sitting on top of his cage. This guy eats continually, by the way. I guess because he's young. But he just never stops eating. He's either eating seeds or he's eating um, Lefebvre's Nutriberries, or he likes pomegranate seeds. Um, loves sunflower, but I don't like to give him too much sunflower. Okay, but he just eats. If he's not eating, he's sleeping. But he's a baby, so I guess that's what he's going to do. So let's see the Timna. Morgan. Morgan! Oops. Camera. He's camera shy. This guy talks up a storm, but he's not going to do it on camera. To get him to talk on camera, you got to fool him. you got to set the camera up with a remote button and leave the room. Then he'll start calling to me. Carl, want to come sit? Carl, come sit. Carl, what you doing? Carl, what are you doing? What are you doing? <coughs> Want to talk? <coughs> Come on, say something. Hello. Are you? A Go ahead, talk. <coughs> what? That was a <coughs> horse. 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 Yeah. 
He is so so smart that uh, if I were to tell you, <laughs> if I were to tell you, you'd think I was crazy. When the other bird died, the cockatiel died. He waited about two days and he started saying, "No more Zoe. No more Zoe, Morgan." Now we have the other bird that I'm thinking of calling monkey. <laughs> Morgan's a great uh, pet. I don't know. What? I don't know who's the pet. Me? Am I Morgan's pet? Or is he my pet? <coughs> he likes me. Cough. Cough. Right. <laughs> That's right. You hear him? You heard me cough, so I said cough. Morgan. <coughs> cough. Yep, cough. Anyway, he, he is more trusting of my wife, Farmer, than of me. But he's a male bird. Now here's something even Mark, who I respect as a great expert in this area, disagrees with me about. If you're going to get a parrot and you're a man and you want a parrot to be your pet, get a female. If you're a woman, you get a male parrot. That's the way it works. The males like females better. The females like males better. So, I bought the Jardine, had him sexed, and guess what? Just like Morgan, he's a male. And I figure both these birds are going to outlive me. They're in my will. And the son who gets right of occupancy of the house, fortunately, likes the birds, but must leave the birds exactly where they are when he occupies the home. And if my other son, who lives in Tokyo, Japan, finds out that he doesn't keep the birds, the house goes on the block. How's that, huh? He's, you know, you've got to respect these things. They have lives, too. This is, you know, they live here. This is their home. We're their family. You don't just all of a sudden change everything for them. Although everybody else does, but that's not me. So let's go back to the monkey bird, Jardine, who's still eating because that's all he does. The cockatiel was a great little pet. The last day she was just about dead. And if I put my finger out, she tried desperately to sit on it, but just couldn't maintain her balance. It was terrible. What, Morgan? Oh, well. So for those of you who have not seen the greater Jardine, there it is. We'll see how she looks a year from now. He looks a year from now. supposed to change. The color of the eyes are going to change. They're gray now. They're going to get, I think, orange. There's going to be a lot more. There's going to be red in the front of the head, they say. There's going to be a lot of orange in the wings, maybe some yellow. We'll see. I mean, if it stays like this, that's fine, too. Although I would like it to get larger, which uh, Mark tells me he will. Yeah, I took a shot that I'd get a female. It was the only... Now, this is a guy who's got this incredible bird store. He's had one greater Jardine all year. I called another really great bird store up in Scarsdale. They had sold their one and only greater Jardine that they had had all year, too. So they're like from the, the western Congo, like the Timnus. So that's it. You've seen the greater Jardine. We'll see what he looks like in months and years to come.